Oh. oh shoot. Yo, what's good, Josh? Your boy NYC King E here, here with another video. Today video, we upstate New York right now for my dad's birthday, just turned 50. Right now, we about to, you know, play some board games, I'm about to vlog, everything, activities we do. And I'm trying to incorporate more like different con types of content, like vlogging, instead of just only gym stuff. So y'all gonna see more out on my channel. But yeah, enjoy the video, subscribe, like, let me know what you wanna see next. The word. Bow. <laughs> Cheers out to the vlog, nigga. Hey, welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> niggas, <laughs> niggas are doing jumping jacks. This big nitty bitch. So, so I do oh, front flips. What the hell? All right, so for me, I'm gonna give y'all like a little house tour. You know what I'm saying? And people be asking me what camera I use, but I use my iPhone camera. But I got the iPhone 13. But this is what I'll be using. And this is how it looks so far. You know what I'm saying? It's a vibe. You feel me? You know? Nice little view will be out here. And they can't see in, so don't even worry about that. You feel me? That's not even what they got going on. You know? Parents in here. Bob in the head. Little bathroom. Little setup. It's a patio back here, too, which I probably am going to record at some point. Nah, it's, it's S Go. Go break it. Yo, your um, camera drop? Yeah. Yeah. Tap into my um Instagram. ZZZYB60. Right, about to start doing reels and everything of like outfits of the day. So y'all go tap into that. You know, it's definitely gonna be ladies, vibes, Tight, all that. Vibes, man. Alright y'all, so I woke up not too not too too long ago and I just run I went in the living room and everything, but I'm gonna show y'all how it looked, you feel me? Last night. We didn't even end up doing any like boy games because I was just we were just tired. Everybody was tired, so I might go on a hike later on. It is cold outside because you're from New York. And now it's in we we in February, so it's it's been break like this whole entire month, you feel me? So I'm gonna show y'all the view, you feel me? Because I ain't gonna lie, we couldn't see the view because we came here at night time so i'm gonna show y'all that and then food they got everything cooked set up and everything and i'm gonna vlog a little bit more but yep oh. all right so this is the view the view out here is tough you see like the whole lake and everything to use this time as well just to like get to, let y'all get to know me because you know for when i don't be talking on here but yeah i feel like life is just what you make it whatever you think whatever you speak like everything that we say and that we do it matters you feel me like don't think that a lot of the things that you're doing are meaningless how you speak how you tell yourself oh, i'm tired like your mind feeds into it it's all about your outlook on life and that's really what attracts the things around you if you're acting lazy if you're not doing nothing you're going to be around people that do the same thing if you're changing that type of energy if you're if you have some type of ambition and drive the people around you are going to follow it. And not only that you'll be not only an influence to other people but you'll attract the same people seek people that have higher intelligence than you be a sponge and absorb information stop being prideful and let yourself be more humble, you know what I'm saying? Allow yourself to receive information because you can learn from so many people and there's so much I can learn too. But that also comes with experience. That comes with, you know, uh, hardships and obstacles I got to face that build my strength, build my character and build who I am as a person overall. Don't fall in love with the process, but just take your time and understand that every step matters. Every step can be enjoyed and every step you have to have gratitude and be thankful that you're there because you're there for a reason. You're where you're supposed to be at right now. So I just currently walked outside. When I say the view is amazing, the view is amazing. I'm going to show you all real fast. I don't know if the lighting is going to be good over here. Well, it's going to be good lighting regardless, but the lighting in terms of like y'all seeing everything else. This is how it looks. The lake is over here. You feel me? This is like beautiful. Like, I didn't want to just only use this time for my family, but also so I could like have like mental clarity. You understand? Like, use this time to kind of reflect on myself personally and then also refine myself. If y'all don't know, I'm spiritual. Like, I'm a follower of Christ and I believe in God and I believe that God is the reason why I'm here today when it comes to not only just living but also the knowledge that i've learned i feel like we get blessed with a lot of things like boom a new car a business all that 
And then we just like forget who blessed us with those things. We forget that God was the reason that we have it in the first place. Being able to, you know, appreciate things that you have, despite not having what you think you need, that's the most important thing. In these past few weeks, I ain't been consistent. I ain't been uploading. I ain't been recording or anything. But I was like, yo, I'm gonna just use this time to, to record and get myself back, you know, to how I used to be in terms of consistency and my ambition and my like motivation. At times, you're gonna be in a slump. At times, you're not gonna be able to to upload for another week two you don't have any ideas you can't brainstorm it's a part of the process though that's what either makes you different from the rest or the same as everybody else because when everything goes wrong what are you going to do are you going to keep driving are you going to still keep pushing are you going to still find ideas and still push past adversity or are you going to still stay in that slum and just you know stay lazy and not get nothing done so i think i'm going to probably go on a walk probably like jog do something to kind of keep my mind clear you know what i'm saying because when I come back to New York, I'm on BT. Like, I'm about to be uploading OD. I'm about to make, make sure my content on point. Content is on point for y'all. So, but I'm going to catch y'all in the next clip, though. So, yeah. I got my sister doing some push-ups. I'm about to do the same thing. I'm about to set my camera real fast. 100 peace for y'all. Oh. I did 50 so far. You know what I'm saying? I need to get, I need to eat more food. I'm probably like 150, 152, 154. I'm trying to get more bulked up, but you feel me? This is the first YouTube video now. I'm trying to upload every day. Nigga say, God, I can't even go down. <laughs> Imagine you step outside of here and you see a dang bear, bro. You hear all the wind blowing and everything. You think, oh, it's just the wind. Then a bear come out of nowhere. Snatch you. I seen a football over here though, I ain't gonna lie. Also over there, I'm gonna show y'all right now. Seen this football over here, which I don't know if I should pick that up. I used to play football when I was in high school. So like, playing football in high school, ah, that was like my like, it's like, it's in my it's in my nature to play football. Like I love sport, I love all of that. So I feel like picking it up. Y'all see that right there? I ain't gonna lie, I might pick it up, bro. I might later on though. Ah, we still going to work, everybody's still getting ready. It's taking a minute, so I'm trying to occupy the time with like just talking to y'all and just like vlogging a little bit more. We got here like 11 p.m. We're supposed to be here like six o'clock yesterday, at least six or like three. Damn, what's in my nose? We got here mad late and it was dark, so it was mad foggy out here, out here too. And we don't like we didn't even know, like, bro, like we was at first, we almost went to like we won't <laughs> can't speak. We almost went to like the wrong house all of that. It was crazy. Brody's eating the fruits. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, I had like I had like two pieces of those. We got the cantaloupe here. ASMR hurt. I'm out here playing soccer with the balloon. Hey. Hey. We got the full up. Bad, 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 bad. I'm gonna show you all my cards. You feel me? Let me know if you can. Wait, hold on. I need to look at my cards here for real. Hold on, hold on. Wait. Oh, oh dude, that's God how we play. That's how we playing. Wow. Whoop. Wait. Oh. Wow. Oh. Ah. Mm -hmm. Wow. 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 <laughs> oh, that's you got love. That's you got love. I feel like I should. Ah, uh, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> All right, y'all. So we just got out here. Look at the look at the lake. It's cold out here though, but look at the lake. I jogged a little bit, so like I didn't really feel too cold, but I jogged, and this is how it is behind us. It looks amazing. This is how it look. The road. You're gonna barely see any cars even passing in the first place, but you're definitely gonna come here more often, but. He was like, yo, let's just go on a walk and just like enjoy the the nature, you feel me? Definitely a vibe though, definitely a vibe. I love silence in a way to where it gives you time to think about like the right things. So that's why I kept saying earlier, like in the video, how important it is to clear your mind at some point, you feel me? I want to record and I also want to take in the moment. So that's why I like to record a little bit and then still like, you know, have some time to Appreciate what we got going on here, but this is like a huge view of everything. Whew. 
my hands is freezing. I ain't gonna lie, I should have wore gloves or something. And I don't got my clip for the dang mic, so I can't even attach it to myself. I don't know how far we walking, but this brick, bro. Like when I say brick. I know nighttime walk will probably be more vibey. And it's like a little bit warm outside. Come outside with the flashlight, do a little campfire, but it's too cold for a campfire. I ain't gonna lie. Early I was like, oh it's gonna be it's high it's it's like warm a lot. A lot. Like <laughs> It was earlier, it was warm because of the sun being out still. Now that sun is going down. The sun going down pretty pretty fast. So these are like regular things that like look amazing. It's like regular to like the regular eye. Like everybody see this. Okay, it's a road, but like when you're really here and you're really walking this whole thing, you realize how actually beautiful this whole thing is. Let's say something to the camera. I'm his dad, with the boy, right with the man. Um Came here to enjoy the beautiful, my like, beautiful day. And um, we are just having a good time here in, in well, as upstate New York. Very lovely scenery, beautiful day, sunshine, it's nice. Good time to enjoy the scenery, beautiful scenery outdoors. Imagine how it would be coming here in the, in the summer times, because it's, I mean, it's, if it's nice in the winter, so it's better be it's better be even better in the summertime. So yeah. It's gonna be really fun if you it was hot hot outside. Be in the water, be in the lake, you guys have fun. You know, definitely gonna come over here with like a lot more people so you can enjoy the nature and have like more people, like more people the better. Like I mean of course of course if you go alone you can still have a good time, but if you go with more people, I could imagine. Everybody playing dominoes. Oh, when, when, okay, Everybody you playing dominoes. dominoes. Yeah, playing dominoes and stuff. Bye. No, <laughs> hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm not trying to really have this vlog too much with like talking, but. It might be a lot of talking, like, you know, it'll be a lot of vlogging as well, but, you know, I kind of just feel like this one should be a lot, of, a lot more about talking and about helping and about giving information to y'all, too. Y'all don't really know too much about me, so I am gonna just give y'all, like, a small little Q&A. So, one, my name is Emmanuel. I'm 20 years old. Um, uh, you know, I'm from New York, not born and raised in New York, but, but raised in New York. <laughs> I enjoy fitness. I enjoy like, you know, deep things, intellectual things. I'm a follower of Christ. So, so spiritual things mean a lot more to me than the things that are of the flesh. Things mean more to me spiritually than anything because I know that there's something deeper than just everything on the outside. It's something on the inside that we all have. We all have a gift. We all have a purpose of why we're here. I don't feel like I'm here for no reason. I don't feel like Life is meaningless, you know what I'm saying? If you need the motivation, maybe this video is for you. Maybe this is the reason why you tuned in. I feel like God has blessed me with the things that I've learned in my experiences in life so that I'm able to share with other people. Even at a young age, as I'm just 20 years old, you know, I've obtained a lot of information at a very, very early age due to struggles, due to, you know, experiences, trials, tribulations, things that uh, form me mentally, things that, you know, shape me into a better person. My parents played a big, big, big role in my life um, growing up, you know, feeding my, me and my siblings the right things, the right information as we were growing up. And of course, we were really rebellious, but at the same time, you know, we're kids, you know, young kids, we want to do what everybody else is doing. We want to follow the same trends. We want to follow this and that. But at some point, you got to learn the hallway. And so those are the things that I'm grateful for. Feelings are a very, very, very um, important thing to learn. Your mind has a lot of power. Our feelings have so much power over us because we feel, 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 feel instead of let me do what's best for me. Let me think about the logical answer. Let me think about what is smarter. I feel like things like that is what makes you different from other people is if you're not relying just on your feelings and your emotions too much. You know, we even make bad choices in terms of anger. Like we'd be in an argument with some people and we say certain things out of anger. Learn to control your emotions, self-control and being able to control your emotions Will get you so far in life imagine how powerful you could be if you can control your anger if you have the patience you know what i'm saying you could be late for work and be so aggravated oh the train's not working or the bus is not working or there's so much traffic you just 
got saved from getting hit by a car or whatever it is, but you're complaining about being late for work. I just wanted to personally talk to y'all and feed whoever is watching information that they could use or it could be useful. So, boom, ski. That's how we looking right now. You feel me? We just finished eating. We, I, I didn't record us really eating too much because we was just like hungry. Gonna sing happy G day to the pops. Ready? One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> what do you got to say to the camera for people that want to turn 50? <laughs> Number one is God. Not me. Oh. I did not put myself to the 50. God gave me and blessed me to see 50. So number one is God. Number two, eat healthy. Healthy. To stay healthy. Exercise and eat right. All right? The key is eating right. 90%. Even the Bible says that. The Bible says that bodily fitness profit little. So 99% is what we put in. Mm -hmm. Alright, so what, whatever you put in is important. So pay attention to what you eat, people. Yep. Boys, girls, ladies, gentlemen, everyone. Amen. Yeah. 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 I just changed my shirt. It still looks nice though, regardless, but for me, because I was hot, because I had like the long sleeve on. But um, yeah, we had a great, great, great time, bro. We had a great, great time. I had ate a lot of food. Like, I ate a lot of food. And then plus the cake. And I'm full, and I feel like taking a nap. I'm tired, like, bro. Uh -uh. I'm so grateful and thankful that I was with my family. I was able to celebrate my dad's birthday with him. And he told y'all the secret to, to, you know, living longer is one is God. God gonna give you life, and then two, how you eat, what you put in yourself, it's gonna come right out of you. So, you feel me? I'm probably gonna record uh, some more content with us leaving tomorrow and everything. I probably record as much as I can. I don't know how long this video is gonna be, and I'm hoping we have a I have a lot of clips in here. I'm, I'm hoping I got everything in here, but you know what I'm saying? I'll see what I'll, I'll do when it comes to editing. But even though the video hasn't ended, I'm, I'm glad that y'all stayed if you stayed for this long. And I'm hoping that you enjoyed the video for this long or how far we got. You know what I'm saying? Next clip, we'll see what I, we'll see what we do. Because everybody food digested. Everybody might take a nap, which is what I was thinking about doing. I had put some bets in, you feel me, for that for this, for tonight game, you feel me? Hoping I hit, but yeah, nothing beats spending time with the family, bro. Like, especially like when you have a lot of money, whatever it is. Like, you know, people, people say that money money equals happiness, but it's like, what is money when you can't spend the time that you have with the money with people? Like, what is it without sharing? What is money without being able to create memories with the money? You know, going on resorts, trips, you know, having fun, having family, having friends, having the people around you. And the ones that you meet along the way in this thing called life, that's what makes life better. You know what I'm saying? But of course, number one, keeping God first. And then being able to just show love to other people and just appreciate what you got and appreciate every single moment. Because every single moment matters, you know. Even when I look back at going, like, even when I look, look back into high school days and everything, you know, my parents always told me, you're going to miss high school once you leave. And I'm like, nah, 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 because I didn't like school, but... The memories that we made in the hallways, in the staircase, when we skipped class, you know, those things is the things that you miss. I personally don't live with any regrets. I'm grateful and I'm thankful and I've felt like I've appreciated a lot of the moments in my life. So, you know, I'm just open to just making more memories and I'm excited to see where God takes me. So, I don't know why I'm thinking about starting like a podcast too. Like, people be telling me like, yo, bro, you should start doing podcasts or you should probably be like a motivational speaker or whatever it is because I talk a lot. But I don't be uploading any of the, any of the content that I post or that, or that I make because I'm like, I sound stupid. I don't sound right. I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I get in my head about it, you feel me? But I realize that the things that I struggle with are the things that I have to keep continuing to do to get better at it. Like, you'll get caught struggling with certain things and especially new, new things that you never tried. And when you're uncomfortable, but you get comfortable being uncomfortable, which is a, a, a saying that I know that y'all heard before. But when you get comfortable being uncomfortable, I promise you. You're unstoppable. You can get anything done that you want to get done. Like, I'm telling you, like, just put yourself in a space where you force yourself to get to be better. Then it's like, okay. Me talking on the, um, on the camera, it, it wasn't ever, it was never hard. It was just the fact that I felt like I didn't sound right. I felt like what I said didn't really make sense. It's like, we think we look weird doing it and everything. In all reality, 
that's regular content, bro. People are not worried. Everybody's human at the end of the day. People see your content, and they're not thinking of things that you're thinking. But, you know what I'm saying? Don't let your your, your thoughts get in the way of um, your success and, you know, getting into a new task and new things. You know, just be just be you, and people going to love you for it. People don't really know who I am, but through what I post, y'all going to see who I am. Y'all going to see my character. Y'all going to see my personality and who I really am. But, you know, that's just shown through just being me, and just putting this camera up and just recording. It's not, it's not something I'm used to, but I'm doing it. So, yeah, I hope that whatever I have said has motivated somebody, has got to somebody. I don't even know how much views it's going to get, but it's going to get to somebody. So, so now we about to start leaving. Everybody packing up their stuff. My dad packing the trunk. It's about to be a farewell to the to the Airbnb. You feel me? Had a great time. Everything. I'm probably gonna record my outro when I get back to the crib. So I'm gonna fast forward. Not even fast forward, but I'm gonna I'm gonna cut the next clip to when we back in the town though. So yeah. <sighs> Alright, y'all. We back in the towns finally, bro. I just drove back freaking two hours or something minutes drive. It wasn't horrible. We got we got home faster than how it was going there. We home. I got like a bit of a headache. I'm tired. I'm probably gonna nap. But it's the ending of the video. You feel me? I hope that y'all enjoyed or took some away from this vlog. Um, you feel me? I had a great time. I'm just grateful. I'm thankful to be back home. Thank God. And you know what I'm saying? I'm just open to getting more content done. I'm keeping that foot on the gas. And you feel me? I just hope that y'all really enjoy it again. There's nothing else really to say. So you feel me? Like, subscribe, turn on post notifications if y'all want to see another video. Let me know. Drop down. And yeah, we out. Get off.